Number 158 from the imprint collection is Dersa Urzula from a renowned filmmaker Akira Kurosawa released in 1975 this was filmed in a period where Kurosawa was really struggling to get finances in his home country taking some money from the Russians to go and make this uh, fantastic film which is basically about uh, the partnership of two men coming together general appreciation working together to survive within the wilderness Captain. Это самые главные люди. Это люди пропадай, все пропадай. So we have a, a Russian military explorer who is tasked with making topographical maps of uh, mountain ranges and forests that haven't really been explored. When he's in there with his crew, he stumbles across our titular character, Dersu, and there forms a bond with a man that he truly appreciates. Я был восхищён этим Гольдом. Он обладал удивительной проницательностью, выработанной всей его жизнью в тайге. And as it opens up, you are thrust into this wonderful world, this 70 millimeter uh, film that just has these outstanding and beautiful images all the way through it that are just Wow, they're just amazing to see and we see these characters bond as they have this mutual respect for one another. When Dursa first joins this group of explorers, they kind of laugh at him. They laugh at the way he talks about the world, the land, his customs. They just think it's funny. Живой, huh? Да. Огонь все равно люди. With except from the captain, whom is weirdly um, transfixed by this character and how he has lived his life within the wilderness, how he has survived, how he can read the land and they become firm friends. Sharing a bond, learning from each other and just traversing the, the, the land as they are making these maps. And it's a rather simple story with not much of a real narrative pushing it forward, but a firmly entertaining story that gives us wonderful characters, exciting moments and pushes us to examine way of working with nature rather than against it and with um, you know, other people as well. There is a wonderful sequence, uh, many wonderful sequences, but there is one where uh, we find our two leads, Captain and Dursa, they are stranded, they have kind of come apart from their troop, there is a storm brewing, they're stuck on a kind of frozen tundra and they have what seems like not a lot of time to really build a shelter and get through it and Dursa just straight down, let's get to work, let's do this and saves the Captain's life by creating um, a shelter for them to survive the night and it's this wonderful sequence of just Dursa just reading the signs, seeing what's happening with the, the, the weather and, and adapting and just dealing with it. Not angry, not panicking, not outraged, just this is what's happened, here is how we react and saving the captain's life just creates that unbreakable bond between these two people. And as the movie goes forward, uh, there's kind of ups and downs, there's separated period uh, for our two characters which to be honest, was a bit of a downer because I wanted them back together. There is a kind of sad wrap round about this one as well. Um, but the absolutely stunning photography, the, the wonderful performance from our lead actor uh, as Dursa Urzula is just absolutely mesmeric. <laughs> It looks terrific, the performances are touching and effective and the story is downright captivating. That plight of people just in the wilderness struggling to survive is just a fascinating topic which I just loved. It does become a little bit downbeat and sad near the end as we kind of see where our character goes but up until then everything about this movie just sung to me, it was absolutely wonderful. I loved the way that uh, Dursu cohabitated with the land, the way he always did things and thinking about other people, trying to help people he may never meet but leave them provisions and a shelter in case. 
Спасибо, Дерсу. Спасибо. Что бы я делал без тебя? Вместе ходи, вместе работай. Спасибо не надо. Dersha Urshula was absolutely fantastic. From the moment I put it on, I was transfixed by this wonderful photography, the stunning images, and then we get into the story and the characters that I loved, and to see them kind of bond was just outstanding. And for it to just be about a case of working with the land, working with each other, and surviving was so fantastic. Even little moments. You know, at the start when Dursha joins this group, he's, uh, the captain's always walking behind and then they share a moment where they, he wants to thank him and it's just like, no, we work together, we survive together and from that moment forward, they're kind of on level pegging. Uh, they'd always walk together, there's no one forward, one behind. It's just little moments like that throughout the movie were just wonderful to experience. This, this is a fantastic film and a great pickup. The disc is loaded with extras. I think you should pick up this movie. I think this is pretty fantastic. Um, I've not seen a Kurosawa movie that hasn't wowed me um, as yet. And this is another one to add to that. From Imprint, an essential purchase for any film fan. I cannot rave about it highly enough. Everything about it is absolutely pitch perfect. Top class. Amazing. I would love to know your thoughts of this movie. Let me know in the comment box below your thoughts. And don't forget to hit the like button when you're down here because that really helps. There's more content up here if you want to see more of my stuff. And in the description box below there are links to the Patreon, the membership program, landvfilm.com. All ways in which you can support the running of this channel which is greatly appreciated. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time on Man V Film.